Olá right, pessoal, meu nome é André e bem-vindos a Hogwarts Legacy ou Hogwarts Legacy, é mais like it. Um, and in the last gameplay, we did a quest where uh, we had to uh, meet Deke and he uh, taught us how to rescue beasts. And that was it. Uh, that has uh, opened uh, a few more quests. Uh, so we need to go meet Natty and also we need to take the astronomy class. By the way, guys, um, I don't know if I... Hopefully, you won't see any difference because I might be able to uh, tune this up in editing while editing the video. <clears throat> but I have... Well, there's no microphone in front of me at the moment. Well, it is, but it's further away. Because I've been uh, uh, noticing that my microphone has been crackling. Uh, it, ha it has been uh, making noises that uh, they're not supposed to be made. Um, and the nvidia software that i'm using usually uh can remove that noise but it muffles my voice so i removed my microphone from my stand and i changed the the cable that connects to uh the computer but the other cable that i had is short or shorter so i had to move my microphone closer to my computer so my microphone is further away from me uh but closer to the computer That might actually mean that two things might happen. My voice might get a little bit different because there's more, more echo in the room. And it might pick up, unfortunately, uh, the keyboard or the, the controller uh, or the, the, the fans from the computer. Hopefully, the NVIDIA software will remove all of that. And if the issue is with the cable, things should run smoothly. Otherwise, it's just a problem with the microphone and I need to, I might need to uh, replace it. So let's see how it goes. Um, okay, so uh, usually the uh, classes are uh, faster. So I'm gonna go to the astronomy class first because if it's really fast, I can just try to do, uh, what's that? In the shadow of the bloodline, speak with Sebastian. Why is it, see that there's a different icon? What's that? Relationships. Ah, so assignments, relationships, side quests, and main. Ah, interesting. What's that? Oh, the, the ones that we did. Ah, okay, so let's go to the astronomy class. But I, uh, let's just locate it on map. Ali Puma. And the map should theoretically. Uh. Oh, nice, but there you go. So it's going to be right there. Is this? Okay, that's done. Travel, nice. Okay, let's see how it goes. It actually, it it's actually a little bit confusing for me to not have the microphone right in front of my face. <laughs> I'm not used to that. I'm just having like the microphone here, and my, uh, my hands go beneath the microphone all that stuff. Now I'm free. And it's a little bit confusing. Let's see. But hopefully the sound should be good. Probably not better, but good. Okay. We need to go there. You Wait. Can't imagine how inconvenient Crevo. travel ah. was before I invented flu powder. I think there, uh, there are many, many uh, players complaining about the flu thing. But you can actually turn it off. I don't mind it. So. Begin. What are we supposed to, I didn't even, I didn't even read the quest. And your reading is the dragon. That's exciting, I suppose. <laughs> Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Probably. Hola. Ladies. Professor Shah. Shah. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. Painstaking. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight we will be on the observation deck. Okay. <clears throat> Ok, 
Can't you find a do a spell Still to warm up? Have your own? You can't be the new student forever, you know. Oh, you can share Boomba. with Mr. Takar. Takar. <laughs> Here, okay. I can adjust that for no, you. No, no, bring it. No, 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 no. On your own. Boomba. Okay. Oh. Oh. Tunga. You got it. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of class. Is that clear? But, Professor, sure. it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very self-same stars above us. Above us. Is that clear? <sighs> Dismissed. <laughs> Please tell me that it's not this simple. Of course Hello it's again. not, right? Brilliant class, wasn't it? No. I prefer astronomy over portions, don't you? No. Of course, we Ravenclaws tend to do well in any class. <laughs> oh, nice. Hello, Amit. Nice to see you again. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. Oh, that's very nice of you. Uh, yeah, thank that's you. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. Yes. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. Sure. But my old model's not too shabby either. Okay. Goblin cut glass, first rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, uh, sure. I. Thank you, Amit. Thank think you, Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. Sure. I have some, uh. Reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Hmm. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Find a mid's telescope. Ooh. Oh. The constellations are beautiful. I'm not sure they're worth dying of a cold for, but they <laughs> are beautiful. Hola. Okay. Professor Shah is just about as cold and distant as the bloody stars she wants us to chart. <sighs> not how I wanted to spend my evening. You not are. sure what you can learn from Eat these that. astronomy tables that you can't learn from a cup of tea leaves. So that uh, weather thingy. Okay, well, let's just see if I miss something here. Apparently not. Okay, let's go here. Below. Oh, where's the thingy? It disappeared. Okay, that's the one. Thank you. Unidentified neck item. Okay. Ah. Shh. Ah. Collect field guide person. Okay. Let's spin that thing, and now let's collect this was that his thing. old telescope. Looks practically brand new. Find a mitt on the lower deck. Ah, a pristine night for stargazing. Do not let it be wasted. Professor Shaw, I'm interested in learning no, about astronomy. No. It is increasingly rare to find a student who seeks after things celestial of their own accord. But if you truly desire to chart the courses of the cosmos, you must rid your mind of the terrestrial babble of others. We ourselves are not unlike blank star charts, you know? Empty canvases waiting to be inscribed with all that the universe has to offer. Do you understand? Yes. I noticed you dismissed. Oh. Am I right in thinking you are unimpressed by divination? Of the unimpressed. many other so called disciplines taught here, divination is perhaps the most feeble, especially in its nonsensical practice of astrology. Do not confuse astronomy and astrology. One is concerned with mysteries stellar and lunar. The other is mere lunacy. <laughs> you mentioned astronomy tables earlier in class. 
What were you talking about? Long ago, devotees of the astral arts set up stone slabs across the countryside. They are ideal for studying constellations near and far. For centuries, wizards made use of these astronomy tables for stargazing. Tables. Sadly, they have since become mere monuments to the intrepid intellectual pursuits of a bygone epoch. Epoch. Thank you, Professor. I look forward to stargazing. I am glad to hear I it. I don't. Should be okay. a stellar night for it. We're done? We are done. Let's go talk to Amit. Aha! Amit thinks he knows everything. Even told me he can speak gobbledygook. Sounded like gibberish to me. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Oh, boom. Boom. Astronomy telescope. This stellar... This telescope is the finest stargazing instrument of its kind. Perf perfect for viewing the moon and the stars and anything else one might find in the sky. In the night sky. Can I look at it? Oh, you can actually... I had heard about these, these things. odd stone tables out in the highland. Perhaps that's what Professor Shah was talking about. Maybe they can rise up their telescopes instead of being... You know what I mean? Just stand up. But okay. Uh, okay, let's meet uh, Quaze. What's his name? Why? It, did the game update it or something? Because that thing is not showing up as it used the to. Perfect night for. Oh, hello again. Ah, hola. I have the telescope. It's nicer than I had expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> but there is um something else. Yes. What is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. And, and you like how finding it? So... Ah, now that's a bit tricky to say that. Oh, it came with a catch. No, it's pretty and nice. you need someone to help you find it. I do. Are you in? No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... <laughs> Well, they are cowards. <laughs> Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. We're done. Sound exciting. Sound is it exciting? Oh, I need to convince I'm in. me. Let's get going. Brilliant. You won't regret it. Now, shall we? Okay. Oh. Here. Out. The table is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform. Something that Valia. doesn't quite belong. We'll know it when we see it. Onwards we go. Some say the locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs for ritual stargazing. Okay, centaurs. Short. Yay. Huh. It is nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Happy to be here. It is good to leave the classroom now. Ah, uh, you're already at your destination. It's I wonder not if... that creepy out here at night, is it? No, quite The Gobstones Club are cowards. Here I am, charging ahead. Uh, why don't you lead the way? Uh. If you're sure. Revelio. Okay. Find the astronomy table, sure. Hmm. A little foreboding. Let's... A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Oh, of course. Okay. It's just not as Revenia. tidy as I expected. Oh, yeah. Nice. Pick it up. There you go. Caged bathtub. This bathtub has been kept behind lock and key for as long as anyone can remember. Rumor has it that the tub was enchanted to chase after students decades ago who were too obsessed with their studies to care, to care much for personal hygiene. Should we open this? Okay, we can. Caged bathtub. Okay, let's go inside. Revelia. Oh, the game loaded. Okay, right, let's pick this up. Flora Fedora. Flora Fedora. Let's talk to him. Amit, could I ask?
ask you something. Oh, um, certainly. Oh. Where is this table? Why the fascination Why with stars? Why are you so fascinated with stars? I suppose because there is so much to learn about them. I mean, there is plenty to learn about a lot of subjects, but astronomy seems limitless. Always something new being discovered. They are forever discovering new moons and stars. In fact, they discovered a new planet just 50 years ago. Just 50 years ago, okay. Where is this table? Where precisely is the table we're looking for? According to an old astronomer's chronicle I found in the library, it may be somewhere along the castle wall. Okay. Actually, that's all I wanted to know. Oh, very well then. Oh, oh, very well. Okay, so. Yeah. More cobwebs. You don't think any spiders might be lurking about? Yeah, probably. Oh, no, look at this. There's a the table. The I There's think the table. You should do the honors. Go I on, should try it out. What am I supposed to do? Use the astronomy table. Ah, okay. Oopa. The constellation should appear near the center of your view. As soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. Okay, can I... Uh... Ah! There you go. A harp. I liked it. I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. And your contribution was invaluable. Invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoirs one day. Thank you, I guess. I look for... Ah, uh, ha! If you... Get us. There's always a bad line. Thank you, Emmett. I look forward to reading them. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> okay. This is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest. All beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. Worthy. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. Thank you. Okay. You're welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I know. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. It's yeah, all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. R's. Um, anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. I will see you soon. <laughs> Quest complete. Okay, challenge unlocked. Find astronomy tables. Oh, never do get tired of seeing the astronomy tower at night. What a view. What a view. Okay, let's just check a few things. Uh, quests. So that's done. The high keep requirements. Wingardium Leviosa, which we have in level 17. So guys, I'm going to leave the game here. It's been 18 minutes, almost 19. Uh, I'm going to do the next mission right after this. Uh, and I just need to check out my microphone to see if there's no evident uh, noise that I'm not realizing. I don't know how people can actually talk and listen at the same time. I I will try it one day, but there's a way in which I can just connect my uh, headphones to the microphone uh, so that I can speak and listen to myself at the exact same time. And that will probably uh, allow me to understand if my microphone is working or not. But as I've said, I've never I've never done that. Uh, so I'm probably missing out on something <laughs> that's very good. But it is what it is. Guys, I'm going to leave the game here. Now we'll return right after this to see uh, if we can make the high keep. Uh, and uh, unlock the other two uh, quests that are missing to make this one uh, this big main quest. That's it, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little gameplay. And as always, I hope to see you all on my next video. Bye-bye.